Hey everybody, it's me again. You saw me get inks if you watch my channel. If you don't watch my channel, then you're not seeing this, so we're good. Um, and of course, there's only one thing that it could possibly mean when we get inks, and that is making swatch cards. Wait, why is this all crooked? Can we do that? Let's hope so, because we just did it. So we got this. Got this notepad over here from before. I'm gonna put some little swatches on there too, I think. So we're good. Everything's ready. Let's burn our thing. You're not supposed to have to do this every time, and maybe I don't, but who doesn't like setting stuff on fire? I mean, I didn't set anything on fire. Everybody, please don't. One time I got it too hot and I, um, when you heat metal and like you temper it, it'll turn this like golden honey color and I did that. So don't temper your flex nibs or they don't flex. Uh, just going to put that out there. So let's see, which one am I most excited about? I think we're going to do this order because it's kind of like, okay. Um, I had construction people here. You're not going to see this today. Oh, the neck of this bottle is so wee. And it's a squishy bottle. Um, I think in other uh, terms, it might be called plastic. <clears throat> so this is Petricor, which I think is the name for the smell of soil after the rain. Feel free to tell me I'm right or wrong about that if you know. Um, I'm not wearing my glasses. Uh, so this is going to work perfectly for me. Just going to put that out there in advance. Just dump all that ink on the page. This is the right way to hold it. Okay. Somebody take a note of that, please. Thank you. Oh, weird. So I got a new toy of sorts. It is, um, what's this called? Chromatography paper. So you put the ink on there. Then you dip the end in water. And it'll make the ink split into its component colors. It's honestly pretty magical. Hopefully you're seeing that okay. I think that's it because I think I'm starting to see plain water. But 
you dry. Maybe we'll move you that way a little. This awkwardly places everything for me. Good job, Maria. I got my glasses. Usually I like to let this sit. Ooh, cover. Does that make you think of wet earth? Look at it. Super neat. Okay. Oh. Now we have abalone this looks like the that is no something about it look like the back of the card Don't be like that. Nib doesn't want to write. Doesn't want to hold this ink. So this ink must be fairly watery. Thin. Um. Sometimes fire helps. Okay, this was the way to hold it. This color is so beautiful. Oh my heavens. Oh my goodness, that other color on the paper. Holy cow. Y'all, y'all were excited about this right up here. Now the question is, do we want to do... Nope, too late. Okay.
okay. Abalone. Just wait till you see this other paper. I mean, you can kind of see it. It's back there. Then. Milky Ocean. Open it up. Move back to improve focus. Yeah, I'll move my arm in a minute. I'm excited right now, okay? Thanks. No, that didn't help. It still doesn't want to hold on to this nib. I'm gonna run out of space. Oh no. Got there. Whew. Whew. Lucky. can't see the water level. I think I got it wet, like the ink. You're not supposed to do that. This one's less complex. Yeah, that's it. I mean, I mean, you're right, it's beautiful. I kind of feel like I want to go treat myself to some kind of nice lunch because I've been locked up in here, but it's ridiculous. I haven't been locked up. I mean, I just didn't, couldn't leave because of construction. I also couldn't come upstairs. I couldn't go to the bathroom. It was great. So... This is exciting. So here's my new inks. Milky Ocean, Abalone, Petrichor. Um, curious what your favorite is. Let me try and uh, give you like a close up for what the colors actually look like. Um, 
in the writing. Because again, that's what you're going to see, right? When you write with an ink, no matter how amazing this swatch looks like, you're, it's not going to look like that. It's going to look like this. So here's neat. Let's take you off of the little tripod that is literally perched on the edge of the table. And these are in backwards order, but look at that. So that's Petrichor on that paper versus this paper. So there's what it looks like in the writing. Abalone. You know, I almost didn't buy this one and it might be my favorite. That's funny. And Milky Ocean, which is the one I wanted the most. Not disappointed in it at all, but might not be my favorite of the three. Not sure yet. I'm going to have to spend some time with them, put them in some pins, get to know them. Um, and then again, check out this wicked chromatography for Petrichor. Crazy. Anyway, hope you liked this. If you reply, let me know which of these three you would most want to have in one of your pens. Thanks.